Not you, Vera. Right. He will be. I know, but when you can't phone him when you want, I mean, well, you don't know, dear. Do I hope he's here. Are you Terence Edgar Duckworth? I am. Thank you. Sit down, please, will you? Here. That looks like that copper that's trying to frame him. Looks the right devil. Your Honour, can the prosecution have until the 20th of December to serve the papers on the defence, with a plea and directions hearing two weeks after on the 3rd of January? Are those dates agreeable to the defence? Yes, Your Honour. What is the likely plea? Charge of attempted murder, I see. Not guilty, Your Honour. Is the defendant in custody? There's no application for bail, Your Honour. <clears throat> Mr. Duckworth, will you stand, please? Terence Edgar Duckworth, your plea and directions hearing will take place oh, in this. God. Oh, God. Oh. So with... ah. Are you all right, Mr. Duckworth? Oh, yes, Your Honour. It's just a, oh, just a bit of stomachache. That's all. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's gone now. Your plea and directions hearing will take place in this court on the 3rd of January 2002. In the meantime, you will be remanded in custody. That will be all. You need a nice bowl of porridge to settle that stomach. I need a toilet. Can't it wait till you get back? I need to go now. Where are they? This is all we need. Oh. Oh. Right. Either come in or stay outside. I don't care which. It's not going to be pretty. Oh. He can't get out of here. Let's wait outside, shall we? Is that five minutes? How long shall we give him? <clears throat> Had an accident. You're joking. I'm really sorry, guys. Well, how bad is it? Oh, see for yourselves. I did try and warn you. <sighs> There's nowhere to run, mate. So what do we do now? Well, we just have to wait now. Yeah. Oh, Terry! That's not now, man. Oh. Stop him! You will flip me up for this, Raiden! Which way did he go? Well, he can't have gone far. You go that way! Well, where's he gone? I, I don't know, he just ran past. I'm sorry about this, love. He's the one who'll be sorry when we catch him. He's just made a very big mistake. <laughs>